And hey, well, this is Francisco from Wondershare Dr. Phone. On Android, you do get a lot of options for unlocking your device, all based off of your own personal preferences. And unfortunately, that kind of freedom can come with consequences, especially when it comes to pattern locks. And in today's video, I'm going to show you exactly how to unlock your Android phone if you've got a disabled pattern lock, for instance, which can happen to the best of us. So let's go ahead and dive right in. While we're at it, why not subscribe to our channel as we tend to upload a bunch of different tutorials for your mobile needs. And leave us a like and share this video if you end up liking it as it is going to be a very useful one. So here we go. If you want to unlock the pin, pattern, password, or any kind of lock on your Android device, then simply take the assistance of Dr. Phone, Screen Unlock, or Android. It is a highly useful and advanced application that can let you move past the lock screen on your device without causing any harm to it or deleting its content. If your phone model is not Samsung or LG though, it is going to erase the data after unlocking the screen. To learn how to unlock pattern lock using Dr. Phone, go ahead and follow these steps that I'm going to bring up right now. So step number one, install Dr. Phone on your computer to perform the pattern unlock. Now from the home screen, just make sure to select the screen unlock option. And then number two, I just connect your device to the system and once it is detected, click on the unlock Android screen button. Number three, I just put your phone into its download mode and then turn that off and long press the home, power, and volume down key at the same time, though this is going to vary depending on what device you have. And it's going to show you what the steps are depending on what system or what phone you're using. And then you're finally going to enter download mode after following the steps on the screen. And number four, the application will just automatically detect once your device will enter download mode. So you don't have to worry too much about that. Then number five, just go ahead and sit back and relax as it will start downloading the recovery package and perform the needed steps to unlock your device. Number six, you're going to be notified when the process is finally completed and simply disconnect your device and access it without any pattern lock. And then you're pretty much good to go from there. Now, here we go with method number two. And this is also going to be a very useful one. And besides Dr. Phone, of course, there are also going to be a few options to learn how to unlock pattern locks on an Android device. Though these options are not really as secure or fast as, as Dr. Phone, which is why we do recommend that you end up going the Dr phone route. For instance, like you can take the assistance of Android Device Manager, also known as Find My Device, to do the exact same thing. It can be used to remotely ring a device, change its lock, locate it, or erase its content. To learn how to unlock pattern lock on Android, just make sure to follow these steps coming right up. So step number one is going to be to go to Android Device Manager, which is going to be Find My Device website, and then log in using your credentials. And then a list of all of your connected devices to your Google account will be provided right on screen for you. And as you would select your device, you're going to get various options, erase, lock, and ring. Click on the lock option to change the lock pattern on your device and then provide the new password for your device and write an optional recovery message if you would like. And then apply these changes and exit the window to change the lock on your device. And then this is going to lead us onto method number three. If your device is running on Android 4.4 or older versions, then you can also take the assistance of the forgot pattern option to perform the pattern unlock. And you won't need a third party tool or any other device in order to perform the desired operation. And to learn how to unlock the pattern lock on your device, just go ahead and follow these snaps coming right up. I simply provide any kind of incorrect pattern on your device. And from the bottom of the screen, you can tap on the forgot pattern feature and select the option to unlock your device with your Google credentials and then provide the correct Google credentials of the account that is linked to your device. And then later, you can just go ahead and set a new pattern for your device and then confirm it. This is going to let you access your Android device with the new pattern lock just like so. And that is just going to be a very simple and easy way of getting through to this. However, this is going to lead us straight into method number four, which is also going to be a very useful one and one that I have relied on on the past. And this is going to be through Samsung's own service here. And just like on Android, Samsung has also developed a dedicated feature for finding a device remotely, performing a multitude of other operations on it as well. And the Samsung Find My Mobile service can be used to look at your device, change its lock, wipe its data, and even perform a few other tasks as well. Now, needless to say, the service only works for Samsung Android devices, of course, and you can learn how to unlock pattern 
with this tool by following these instructions right now. Step one, I just go to Samsung's Find My Mobile official website, and we're going to be leaving links down in the description to that, of course, so that you can make sure that you're accessing the correct website. And then just log in with all of your all of your credentials. You can access your device on the left panel, and by default, it's going to provide uh, the location of your device on the map. And additionally, you can just access the various uh, services from here as well. Like, I'm gonna click on the unlock my device option in order to proceed. And now from here, all that you need to do is just to click on the unlock button to perform pattern unlock on your device. And after unlocking your Samsung device, and you're going to be informed of an on-screen message right over here. And it's just going to be a very simple and very convenient way of going about it. That's going to lead us on to method number five. And this is going to be a very simple and effective solution to how to unlock a pattern on an Android device. And nevertheless, this solution will only work for third-party lock screen apps. If you're using your phone's native lock feature, then it might not really work as you might expect. After restarting your phone in safe mode, you can easily move past its pattern lock without any kind of trouble. All that you need to do is just go ahead and follow these steps coming right up. Simply press how the power button on your device to get to the power menu on its screen, and I'll tap and hold the power off option. Now, this will display the following pop-up message and agree to it, and then restart your phone in safe mode from here. And once this device would be restarted in safe mode, and the third-party lock screen would be disabled automatically from there. It really is just that simple. And the lastly, for method number six, consider this as your last resort, as this is going to wipe the data and save settings on your device entirely. As the name suggests, your device would be restored to its factory setting by losing its data, as it should be your last resort. And on step number one, just go ahead and put your phone on recovery mode on your device, and this can be done by pressing the home, power, and volume up keys at the same time. Although the correct key a combination might differ from one version of Android device to another, and it's just going to vary depending on what Android phone you're using in the first place. And choose the volume up and down key to navigate the power and home button make selection and it's going to behave as your ok button per se and then select the wipe data and factory reset option to perform pattern unlock and just make sure to confirm your choice and to reset your device and then just wait for a little bit as your phone is going to perform that needed operation you can actually choose to reboot your phone and access it without any kind of lock screen however this will all come at the cost of all of your data so again this would really be your last resort only. And that's it. Those have been six methods of unlocking your Android pattern lock with and without a factory reset. Personally, I think that the Dr. Phone method is actually going to be the easiest way of going about it. So that's the first thing that I would attempt if I were you. Thank you for watching this video. And if you found it useful, then leave us a like and share it with others who could actually use all, all of these steps. Also do make sure to subscribe to this channel for more content just like this, as we tend to upload pretty frequently. And leave us a comment with any of your questions, of course, down below. We'd be more than happy to answer them. And until next time, enjoy.